So uh, Anthony, a lot of conversation about performance attribution around television. Uh, a lot of, it's sort of a hot buzz uh, sector it seems. You guys have been at it for a while. Tell us about the iSpot TV offering and how you differentiate yourself. Yeah, absolutely. So iSpot, uh, we've been at this for seven years. So we're really the first to get into TV ad measurement um, and also the first to work with ACR data. And so we really have uh, the scale that no one else has. So everyone else is getting into it. And, you know, they, as they say, it's really the people that are coming into it later. They're trying to do the same things we're doing. And they're also uh, attempting to essentially say they do the same things iSpot does. But what we do differently is we actually have a platform that powers what we're doing. We also have uh, the ability to have scale that others do not have. And so really what we do differently is be able to power an always on brand. And so not only when we turn you on, do you have your, your ads that you've had over the history, right? We also look at it and going forward. Whereas many of the people coming in now, they're able to maybe look at an ad, an ad campaign, and they're doing it individually, but not being able to look at multi points of attribution and what has happened in the past and also look at what's going to happen going forward using ad measurement. And so what we provide is really uh, a measurement at, at scale and really something that people can use the day one they come in, right? And so it's not like you have to give us your creatives and we make things up as you go, or you give us your data and then 14 days later we put in a spreadsheet and give it back to you. It's something that right when you log on day one, boom, it's there. So I think, so just uh, get a little bit in the woods a little bit. So um, tell us how you do that and what, you, what the data is that you mine. Yeah, no, absolutely. So we have uh, ACR data, we partner with Enscape. And so through that partnership, it allows us to look at minute by minute uh, viewing, really second by second viewing behavior of TVs, uh, smart TVs, right? And so from that, we're able to apply our metrics, metrics to it, um, lift, frequency, and, and others, right? So uh, TV adware. And so we're able to then put that together as a package and then deliver it out to our customers. So what do the customers want to know uh, from a performance perspective? Yeah, absolutely. So most of our, the people that come to us are looking at getting TV ad spend that is based upon their KPIs, right? Really return on ad spend. And we're able to provide that uh, with our platform. So what are some KPIs, just sort of uh, a range of them perhaps? Yeah, so uh, many of the people where a lot of our growth has come is we actually have um, something similar to Google Analytics where there's a pixel that we provide to our customers. And so they're really right, driving uh, digital types of, of KPIs to their TV ad measurement, right? So if you look at some of the things we're doing with Target and Rondell, so they're really looking at, hey, what type of metrics can we drive that looks at our KPIs for our business and apply those not only in digital types of ways, but also on the TV ad spend. Anthony, tell us a little bit more about the uh, arrangement with Rondell. Yeah, so Rondell, uh, that was a partnership that started well over 18 months ago. One of the things that they did is they looked at several of uh, our competitors. They looked at Samba, Samba, they looked at Data Plus Math, they looked at us and others. And really they had a bake off that said, hey, what is the best what is the best platforms out there? What's the cleanest? What's able to deliver the best data? And they chose us. And the reason why they do that is not only do we have data that we're taking in from Enscape, we also have our own platform in which we have the metrics, as I mentioned earlier, but we do it at scale. And we have many methods in which we look at TVs and devices um, that we decide, okay, what is the right TVs to put in a panel? How do you put that in a panel? How do you extrapolate to the, to the US census and then provide uh, metrics going forward, right? And so that's one of the reasons why they chose us to help power their system as they're doing for their customers. And finally, Anthony, next week we'll be in Orlando uh, together with iSpot, uh, kind of exploring uh, the views of marketers on this changing media landscape. Um, I know you're the CTO, you're not always in touch with the buy side with the customers, but what do you see some of their expectations around television as the medium itself is changing? What are they what are they looking for and what do you hope to provide them? Yeah, so I, I think the, I think first and foremost, the, the, the chance to be actually to treat your TV ads more like digital, right? And look at the digital side as well and look at something holistically is something that people are looking at today. Um, as they look towards us, they look to us for the scalability and not only delivering something at scale, but delivering it in real time. And so as people come to us, that's really what you're getting is return on ad spend and your, and your overall advertising campaigns and multi-touch attribution. 
at scale and in real time.